Welcome back to the channel, guys. Your boy, the host, the one and only Hamza. Okay, you heard this like twice already. For some reason, you guys enjoy when I drink like seltzer water in front of you. So it turns out, according to my statistics on my last two, three videos, okay, the engagement has been off for some reason when I start, you know, bringing my food and water in here. So I guess there is a trick to, you know, bringing oatmeal and coffee into your videos and running outside and fake going to the gym and coming back and all this stuff. So that's my number one secret for you as a music producer if you're on to come up you have to show them what you eat and drink otherwise you won't make it bro and i don't care what plugin you have i don't care what vsc you have what producer connections you have if you're not showing them what you're drinking and eating you won't make it so unfortunately man if you're not comfortable doing that forget about it but today i want to give a shout out to one of our family members his name is prod by kens i'll leave the comment right there so pretty much you watch one of my videos he was like hams listen great b overall i love the channel whatever and he was like you're 808s man they can be better so kens i think that's your name um i tried your method bro and man toast to you bro seriously let me tell you what happened okay so i used to use esx24 when i was making my uk drill beats but then they upgraded logic and they got rid of esx24 so now they got this new sampler i didn't know how to use it to get the same 808 that i had previously but now we got it so today we're going to be making a uk drill beat to celebrate this moment and let's get into this video but before we do make sure to hit the subscribe button with the notification but also leave a thumbs up if you do enjoy the content if you want to follow me on social media there's a link for that in the description and let's have a toast to start the beat all right, guys, so I got this sample pulled up, and I swear to you, I'm not even lying to you, when I found this sample over here, there was no key, no BPM included, but it's fire. So I was like, you know what? Maybe I could work with this, okay? So we're going to try to, like, play it real quick and let you hear it, okay? I know it has a lot of potential, but then now I have to, like, figure out what the key is, the BPM. All right, so what I'm going to do first is set the BPM maybe to like 144. Wow, it looks like it worked, actually. Really? Like 144? That was crazy. It was literally 144. That is complete accident, guys, I promise. That's crazy. It was literally 144. Um, Yeah, that's super weird. Um, But let me add some fading on it to get rid of that click in the beginning and end. Maybe some here. Just make it a little bit smoother. You know what? Let me zoom in first. It looks like there's a bunch of empty space in the beginning. Maybe like that. And then stretch it at the end. That's much smoother. And what I'm going to do is maybe transpose it like one or two steps and see what we could get. I like that right there. All right. Let's fix the EQ on it. Ooh. All right. Let me see. Let me add some halftime on it. Oh. oh my god guys get ready for a fire beat right now i think the first thing i'm going to do right now is add a bell in there and i don't know if i'm going to add a counter melody on this one right here i feel like it might clash with it because i also want to keep it simple on this one to give more room for like the 808s and stuff like that so i'm going to add the bell maybe add some drums if i get a counter melody i'm going to add it in there right after lower the volume on it there you go fix the eq on it There you go. Let it play one more time. Ooh. All right, and I feel like the next thing I want to do is add in the hi-hats. I'm going to just drag in the MIDI from the free pack that I have in the link for you guys in the description. It's completely free, no emails, no signups necessary. But if you do want to subscribe and follow me on social media, that'd be nice. So let me go to the free kit. And I have like um, the 221 formula for the MIDIs as far as the hi-hats. I'm going to just drag it in here. 
find the hi-hat and I think that'll be it for the hi-hats for now. Once I add in the snare and the kicks, that's when I go back and like adjust the pattern on it. All right, so I got the hi-hat pulled up. We're gonna listen to it while I fix the EQ. Super loud. Yeah, should be good right there. All right, and now we're gonna add in the snare. All right, so I got a snare pulled up right now. Let me just show you what it sounds like before I start recording. Just like a classic UK drill snare. That's perfect right there. Man, R, repeat that over. J, we're gonna listen to it real quick while I fix the EQ. kind of have an idea for the kicks um i'm probably gonna go a little heavy on the kicks compared to the normal like uk drill sometimes they just put like the uh, you know the beginning note and just leave it the way it is i might put in like boo, boo, ka. Boo, boo. so we'll see how that goes all right so i got a kick pulled up it's pretty punchy let's see let's see let's see let's see Kind of like that part right here. Hopefully the capture record got it. Yes. Repeat that over, join it, and we're gonna listen to it while I fix the EQ. Add some overdrive on it. I think that's perfect like that. All right, let's see what else we can add in here. I think the next step will be to add in the open hats. So let me try to find something to add in there. All right, let's see. Like right there would be good. Let it come back. Perfect. Repeat that over, join it, lower the volume, fix the EQ as usual. I want it to be subtle. A little bit too much, maybe. Let's get right there. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, the main event, ladies and gentlemen. Again, shout out to you, Ken's. I appreciate you, man. We're about to add in these 808s, and your boy. It's gonna make a fire, okay? I'm gonna add a bunch of glides everywhere and stuff like that. And by the way, um, we had she loves that KT hit me up once. Was like, Hams, I know you're doing a hi hat tutorial. Can you do an 808 tutorial? That's coming soon. Um, there's just a few more elements with the 808s I want to master first. And there's like a few techniques that I want to make sure that like when I explain it, I have a full comprehension of it. So that tutorial is coming soon. I can't promise you it's gonna be this Tuesday, but very soon, my friend. But now let's add in those 80 weights. All right, guys, so unfortunately, my camera turned off and I'm like talking to myself the whole time. Like I'm about to add this here, do this here. Um, luckily, I didn't finish adding the 80 weights. I only created the baseline notes. Um, we're gonna play those real quick and now we're gonna start adding some glass to it. I'm just happy that I didn't finish the entire thing and you're like, did he just skip the entire footage not to show us the 808s? That's not it, guys. The camera just died halfway. But let's just play the bass notes and we're gonna start adding some glass from here. All right, let's start adding some glides right now. See, I'm probably gonna add one here. Whatever, like right here. Let's see what else we can do. Add some more glides here. Maybe I like that right there, but I might just bring this note down here. And I might do that, vuh, 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 just like leave the same notes like this and maybe add like one, two, three, four. 
like that right there, but I might move this note up. That's good right there. Fix the EQ on it. Add some overdrive. Ooh, finally got the 808, baby. Shout out to you, Kens, man. For real, man. Appreciate that. I'm always open to the feedback, bro. Ooh. Hey. 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 All right. I feel like the beat's in a good spot. We're going to arrange it real quick, and I'll be back with the final results. All right, guys. So we got the final arrangement right here, and I feel kind of guilty, but I forgot to change the hi-hats. I don't know what's going on today, guys. The camera turns off. I'm, like, forgetting stuff. Um, I did fix the hi-hat pattern, but I was like, I don't want to tell them it's the, you know, the arrangement and all this stuff. And they're like, dude, you're going to take us back to the hi-hats now? It just kills the flow, okay? So I managed to change the hi-hats on here. They sound fire. And um, yeah, let's just vibe out to it. Sorry, guys. I completely apologize. Next video, I'll make sure to add the hi-hats. Hey, hey. Hey, 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 hey. Bring the kicks in the bell. Ooh. Can't wait for the 808 to come in. This is hands down my best UK drill beat. Ooh. Vibe is crazy on this one. Y'all ready for the 808? has to be all wrapped up so hope you guys enjoyed the video as much as i enjoyed making it this beat came out super fire the choir sound amazing on it the 808s are fire the hi-hats everything on this beat is fantastic hands down my best uk drill beat and again ken's shout out to you man i appreciate the advice because without you right now my 808s would not have been this great so again thank you so much bro but anyway guys if you're new to my channel make sure to hit the subscribe button notification bell. also leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video if you want to follow me on social media there's a link for that in the description including tutorials tuesday free stuff friday just a bunch of good stuff thank you so much for watching you have a wonderful day